Hey, what's up coach? Welcome back to the channel. If you are brand new here, make sure to hit that subscribe button. If you are interested in growing and scaling your local sports training business. Before we tap into today's topic, all right, I want to address this um, because not a lot of coaches that are subscribed to this channel even know about this, but uh, recently I just came out with a step-by-step -step program on how to grow and sell out any sort of clinic or camp that you run in the future. And if you're interested in that, simply go to my website, buildmysportsbiz.com, and you can scroll down that page. Um, I have a complete program there. It's called Big Money Camps. Go check it out, it's on my website. And uh, with that, let's uh, dig straight into today's video. Welcome to the Build My Sports Biz Show where we talk about how to create, build, and scale your own local sports training business. Let's go! It's time to get started with your host, Ben Neighbors. The show starts right now. All right, this is a question I get almost every single day. Uh, this is from new trainers out there that are trying to establish their pricing and what their offer is. And I also see this from coaches that are looking to raise their pricing, all right? And here's what it is. Um, and this sounds like a really annoying thing. If I sent this to you, I think you'd probably be annoyed if you got this. Uh, but this is what it is. It's coach will ask, hey Ben, how much should I charge for my training? All right, now it's a very loaded question. Um, and it's because if you and I have never talked before, if I don't know exactly what you're offering, um, if I don't know the problem that you're solving, then you know I can't say how much I think you should charge. Uh, and even if I did know exactly how much or how much value you're providing, if I say, yeah, you should charge this, and you don't believe that yourself, then you're not going to be able to sell it at that price. This is why when I help coaches, I like helping coaches one on one with their business. This is why like, I do so many Zoom calls every week with coaches individually so I can get to know about their business, about their clients. Um, and that's why like, it's hard for me to come on here and say, yeah, you should charge $300 uh, per month or $3,000 per year. Um, it's not right for me to say that because I shouldn't be the one who defines the value of your business, right? And I just wanna be straight up here. A lot of the coaches that I work with like, no one's offering the same exact thing. Everyone has their own flavor or their own spin on their training program, all right? Not everyone charges the same amount. Not everyone offers the same thing, all right? And based off of what you charge, right, it's gonna come down to your experience, it's gonna come down to your confidence, and it's also gonna come down to your communication, right? Your communication over the phone. I can take someone who is brand new to the training business, right? They can have all the confidence in the world, but if they stutter or they freeze or they just lock up when they get on sales calls, doesn't matter, all right? And then I could take somebody who's, you know, really experienced. Maybe they're not that charismatic. Maybe they're not that great over the phone, but when they get on that sales call, like they know what they're saying, they know what they're selling, and they believe in what they're selling, like, that person's gonna do so much better than someone who's just great at communicating but doesn't close deals, right? So with that being said, your value that you provide, right, and whatever it is you're charging, that's gonna be based on the problem that you solve, right? I'm gonna say that again, like the problem that you solve and the value that you're providing that's where you get paid, right? And for, for example, and I've given this example before uh, on this channel, but a brain surgeon is gonna make a lot more money than a normal doctor, right? And a normal doctor is gonna make a lot more money than someone who works at McDonald's, right? So the further you specialize, the more money you generate. The bigger the problem you solve, the higher, the, the more hiring clients you get to work with. That's just how it works. It's just straight up. That's how this game works. If you are a generalist, 
Um, expect to charge very little amount of money uh, for your sessions. If you are a specialist, you will charge more. And in my mind, the only way to become a specialist is if you get more experience in business. It's hard to be a specialist right out of the gate, right? That's just, it's hard to do, all right? And what we need to do though, and I'm gonna show you something here on my screen. I have a video that breaks down like finances and I don't have a million views on this video, but I would say it's probably one of the most impactful videos I have on YouTube. If you just look at the numbers, right? So if you go to my page and you look at, um, if you just type this in and inside look at how much uh, coaches make per hour template, if you go to YouTube, type that in, you'll be able to see, all right, this video, it's a longer video. I'm looking at it here, it's 21 minutes. Um, and the funny thing is I've looked at the analytics on this video. A lot of coaches watch it for like two minutes because they don't want to sit through a 21 vi uh, minute video. But this will clearly map out like a different examples of how you can charge and the smartest ways to charge, right? And I go through everything very piece by piece so go watch that video if you're having a hard time figuring out what to charge. Um, but what we need to do here is, you know, it shouldn't be, well, I don't know what to charge. It should be what's included in my program, All right, That's the real question you should be asking yourself. Why, why should clients sign up with me? What am I doing that no one else is doing? All right, what am I providing? What's the real problem that I'm solving? And the more specific you get, the more clear it becomes about, oh, this is how much I should charge, all right? And another great question to ask yourself is if you were the customer, how much would you pay for it, all right? If you are unable or unwilling to pay X amount for a service, then it's gonna be hard to command that from clients, all right? So I hope that helps. And uh, if you have any questions for me, all right, I'm gonna have my number pop up on the screen here. Simply just shoot me a text at this number right here. All right, what I do every single day, Monday through Friday, I've been doing this like clockwork uh, since January of 2021. I hop on a 10 to 15 minute Zoom call with you. If you are brand new to my ecosystem, you've never talked to me before, or maybe you've watched or listened to my podcast and you wanna chat, reach out to me, text me there, and I will set up a Zoom call with you later this week. And uh, I'd love to chat with you. Like, that's the way I can help. I can come on here and, and give advice and, and try to help as much as I can. But the way I can really help you is if I can personally talk to you, right? And I leave my, my schedule open every single week to be able to do that. Um, obviously, I can't talk to hundreds of coaches every single week, uh, but I have select times that I am available. And I'd love to chat with you if, uh, if you're open to talking. That's it. And uh, I'll see you later.